Hello everyone, my name is Butter Tongsley, and welcome back to another wonderful episode of Disgaea 6, where we left off. We are now with our new party member, which is, uh, Magdalene, and she doesn't have the most favorable of abilities. I believe, like, if, like, her first one's okay, it's the second one I don't like, which is decreased stats by 50% due to consciousness and performance anxiety. I'm not a fan of that. Um, but she does have this at least to, like, make sure when she's, like, facing a single target, she gets 50% increased damage when equipped with a staff, so... That's at least one thing going okay with it, but other than that, I just, I'm not a fan of that whole 50% decrease stats. That is really bad. Um, but it's not so bad that it's like, we're in danger, Welcome just it's bad chat. that like, she can't have the stats that she would have because of it. Um, but other than that, I say this is still good. And it gives us time to also work with everything in a comfortable, like, calm pace. Because we got some really good, like, um, character composition due to, like, the choices of characters my friends and all of them wanted to be. So, I am glad about that. Let's see if I can strengthen this, which I can strengthen it to three. Okay, I can strengthen it even higher. There we go. I wanted to strengthen it so that way I can add uh, my other friend's character into the experience group. There we go. Perfect. There. Nice. Thank you very much. So we are now going to go to the next level after we see uh, the event with Magdalene and see what happens and then we're gonna go to the next level which I just said oh yeah here we go <sighs> why oh why must I look like this oh come now Magdalene you needn't be so glum about it glum doesn't even begin to describe it Maybe you'd change your tune if you became a 10,000-year-old magician, ma uh, bleh, magical girl. I don't know why I almost said magician girl. This is not Yu-Gi-Oh! Just look at this audacious outfit. Have you ever seen anything so degrading? La la la, oh my, oh me, that get-up suits you to a T. Ah. Uh, agreed. Cute is justice. Cute makes right. S Silence, insolent little whelps. Didn't anyone ever teach you to respect your elders? Ah. Whose bright idea was it to leave my legs exposed anyway? My poor frigid knees. Have some perspective. Now that you have the body of a magical girl, You've got some cool, oh, some cold resistance to go with it. Ah, uh, yes, you make a fair. Wait, no, that is not the issue here. Ah, what a nightmare! I admire them as a child, yes, but being a magical girl at my age is just absurd. Ah, oh, she does have. Magic. Oh, uh, she does have cold resist. Well, actually, she has balanced of all elemental resist, so I'd say it's still good. Must I really remain in this form for the rest of eternity? Don't sweat the small stuff. You'll go back to how you were eventually. Eventually? And exactly what second of what minute of what hour of what year will that be? Huh? Huh? What did your brain get zapped back to a baby form to? 
That should tell you just how troubled by this I am. Eh, you'll be back to normal in 10,000 years, right? Just sit back and enjoy being a kid till then. But I want to turn back right now. Why not try asking the legendary witch for help? If that were possible, you can expect I'd have already done so. But as the legends hold, the legendary witch has long since passed away. Honestly, she could have at least had the decency to leave a less ridiculous memento behind. If only you could turn back time and undo it all. La la la, alas, your naked backs against the wall. Don't go, don't go talk, no, singing about this as though you have no part in it. Turning back time is nothing more than a flight of fancy. <sighs> just what am I to do? I would say, just like Zed says, just sit back and enjoy being young again. And just wait till the day you become 10,000 years old again. But hey, upside is, she has maturity in the body, so that means she doesn't have to worry about doing too much childish stuff. She can just focus on studying and all that like she no doubt wants to do and be boring. <clears throat> Alright, to the magic school and to the library. Let's go. How did it all come to this? You're the one who used that wand thingy without reading the instructions first. That's true, but... I told you not to sweat the small stuff. Don't you want to protect your students from the god of destruction? Just focus on that. Does anything else really matter? Y you may be right, but... No! It's impossible what I happen to look like this! So, you care more about your looks than you do your students? Is that it? Ooh. Uh, th th that's... Hm. I guess they don't mean that much to you after all. S silence! I will not allow myself to be lectured by some pathetic zombie. You call him pathetic, yet he's been kicking all of your security system's asses, which, again, I point out is not a very good security system, being you're using all squishy monster classes. I am Principal Majoline of the prestigious Magi Mage School of Magic! My burden is greater than your existence. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Burden? So whatever burden you got is more important than your students? Well, what about you? You couldn't possibly know what it's like to bear such a burden. Of course I do! Hm. I'll talk, most likely. If that's true, then tell me. Why are you fighting the God of Destruction? Is he finally gonna tell? Because... <sighs> Looks like we've got company. Time to shut our yaps. Dang it! I want to know if I what I think is true is that the reason why he's doing it is because the God of Destruction probably killed his sister. I want to know. Jump power plus thirty, no color change. Oh, so this is an oh whoa okay, no jump level. Oh, of course, and they got bases. But it looks like they got one. Okay, no, they got two. So this is gonna be a little bit annoying. So I'd say start from the bottom and then we'll be up here. Yes, I did a, a music thing. Leave me alone. Yeah, we did it. Nice. So far we're killing them off really nicely, but here I go. they are coming in decent numbers. So no doubt they're getting more reinforcements at the top also, so that's gonna be a bit of a problem. That's all. Oh, they're getting quite a few people. 
boy. Ow! Mm. Capturing. Oh, great. Ow. Was it good for you? <laughs> Here I go. Okay, good. The magic damage actually was not too bad. Thankfully, I, uh, thankfully, like Wolfie wanted to be built purely as a literal pure tank, so they are both really good with resistance and uh, defense at the same time. So they can take quite a beating, thankfully. I am not liking these debuffs, though, that the Succubi keep hitting us with. Because it keeps making us have all stats decreased, which is not good at all. And Zed's close to death. Alright. Here's a tip. Killing off the rest of these enemies down here. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna also right. have Kiori start moving more towards no. the other side. And what? then we're gonna try and get rid of the rest of the enemies at the upper levels. Alright. Can I move her? No. I forgot I moved her to that position. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Um, also, we're gonna use some uh, item here. Which we're gonna use some fairy dust. Or. Oh no, yeah, we need fairy dust, fairy dust, fairy dust. Come on, sir. We don't have any fairy dust. Ugh. Well, that's a bit of a problem. That's fine. I'm sure we'll be able to. Well, yeah, we'll be able to use uh, Mizador's uh, spoiler when next turn comes. Okay, good. Enemy reinforcements is done, so now we can just focus on. Uh, we can just focus on damaging uh, the rest of the enemies that are around. So that's My good. Turn. Oh god, especially to do this. Oh, come on. There we go. Use it. Use these barrels as bandages. Not bad. Okay, there we go. See? All gone. No, no longer a problem. I'm gonna use his turn though to heal him. Not with that. I'll use this. All right. Yeah, perfect. Large amount of health back. And have him start joining the others by starting to move up. So we're almost done killing all the enemies. There's only a few of them left. Having Plastid take care of this one because he has all the damage needed to kill her by himself. Now we just have the few enemies that's up top waiting for us. And speaking of, there's one now. Ow. Capturing. Okay. All right, our turn. It's my turn now. <laughs> Here I go. Nice bite. Come on, there's only two enemies left. I just want to finish them off. I'm trying really hard to, like, get all this settled. I'm probably not even going to be able to really upload any of, like, these videos until around after the 20th because it's being hard being able to, like, sit down to record with this pain I'm dealing with. Like, I know I say that a lot, but it's, like, that's literally the biggest problem here is, like, like, right now my pain I was dealing with actually kind of faded, so I'm going to hope that it stays that way, but I don't know how long that's going to be. Just going to hope. That's all I can do is hope. Now, can we please finish off this one enemy here? You know what? I want to do it with Sky's character. I want to finish them off with Sky's character because I've noticed, like, out of everyone else's, for some reason, like, out of every other character here, like, they keep getting, like, lowest level, but it's also because, like, it seems the ma they made the Mecha Girl class, like, actually very vulnerable to damage. 
Like, the, the mecha girl literally takes quite a bit of damage. Also, we're actually gonna heal so that I can still put up this proficiency. And, of course, add the finishing blow. Because I still need to put up mega heals efficiency so that they can be able to do uh, yeah, I'll Let's go go. Uh, better at healing <laughs> people at further range. Nakama. I'll put you in the throat! Uh, out of my way! Here's a tip. I'm literally wondering also like how close I am to the end. I feel like we're getting close to the end because they said because Zed was talking about how we were just waiting for one more Target member of our party. Fire. So I feel like we're getting literally to the end towards the end here. Entertain me. I don't know though. There we go, some good level ups for everyone. Oh. Oh no, what's happening? Hmm? What's wrong? Can't sleep, Pico? Yeah. I had a scary dream. Oh. This is an adorable scene. Well, do you want to sleep here tonight? Yeah, yeah. Sleep over with Bubby. <laughs> this is too cute. Bubby's super strong, so don't worry. There's nothing to be scared of as long as I'm here. Yay! <laughs> Thanks, Bubby. I love you. Oh No! Biko's cuteness almost vaporized me again! But, but Biko knows. Bobby's not good at fighting. Oh, so in the past he wasn't a good fighter. People pick on poor Bobby all the time. So you saw that, huh? Well, I may be weak in a fight, but do you know what is strong? My heart. No matter what happens. I'll protect you, Biko. Now get some sleep, okay? Okay. <laughs> I love you lots, Bubby. Night night. That is just too cute. That was literally a cute scene right there. And we're gonna have to end off the video there because I'm all out of time. Um, but, of course, we're gonna get right back in, uh, into it with the next video, and I'm gonna be doing quite a bit of recordings. It's now the 18th, and I'm hoping to at least get this game finished before the 20th hits. I'm gonna try my best. Um, cause I don't wanna keep ending up, like, getting a new game on my channel and wanna record a bunch of videos, but not get a game finished. I keep running into games that's doing that, but it's also cause some of the games I wanna get... Some of the other ones I want to get is sometimes also releasing pretty soon, too. So it's it's hard for me to really finish the other game so much. So I'm going to try to, like, just go at it. I'm, I'm going to literally go at it whenever I can, whenever, especially whenever I'm not dealing with the pain. So we're going to save this. I'm going to end off the video here, and then we're going to see you guys in the next video. So with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and ding the bell so that you guys can stay notified of the content that uploads onto the channel. And as always, I'll see you all in the next video. Take care. Have a wonderful, safe, and healthy day. Bye, everyone. It's delicious.